Here with a 2019 19-plate BMW X5 xDrive 30D M Sport. Now it does come with four superb, unscratched, unmarked 22-inch alloy wheels in gloss black. And we also have the M Sport brake calipers just hiding behind. Now we do have the LED headlights as well as the black kidney girls. Full M Sport styling kit, so you do get the front splitter, side skirt extensions, two rear spoilers and also a rear diffuser. There's a look. That's another alloy wheel. Now we do have the Sky Lounge panoramic sunroof, as well as the black roof bars, black window trim, and also privacy glass on the rear. And there's a quick look. That's another alloy wheel. Now we do have front and rear parking sensors with rear reversing camera, dual exit exhaust, which is flush with the rear bumper, and also the rear diffuser. Now if I open the boot, button underneath there, and then it will then open by itself. Now we do have the six seats in this vehicle, so you do have the two in the rear, and you've got the parcel itself just there, just so I can show you the rear seats. As you can see, just there. And you can also fold them down from the buttons just there as well. And you do also have the split fold tailgate, so open it up by the button just there. And it can also lower the rear of the car by pressing that button, so it makes loading luggage easier. And we can see it raising just now. You have to press it again, and the vehicle will then lower. Now we do have the power system tailgate back down again, as you can see, just there. Now this vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches, and rear does look superb from every angle, especially with that M-Sport styling kit and the blacked out look. There's a look at the last alloy wheel. Now I've go to the rear of the car, show a bit of the interior. Now we do have full leather seats throughout, with cushions on the headrest in the, t in the rear. We also have ice fix points, pull down, leather armrest, and we also have the vents in the center with storage and 12 volt connectivity. If you have more storage, you do get the storage behind the driver and passenger seat. Now, you do get two USB C ports behind the driver and passenger seat if you do need to charge any bits of equipment. You also have your integrated speakers, bend with individual trim with ambient lighting, and also electric windows there as well. Going to the front, let's look at the driver's front seat, which is heated, electric, and memory. Now the rear seats are also electric, as you do get the function just down there, as you can see. Now they are heated electric memory, so the electric function is just down there, and the memory function is up there on the door card. Now you do get your electric windows, electric power folding mirrors, you can also open the tailgate there. And you do get your BMW individual trim with your ambient lighting and the integrated speakers. Now jumping inside the vehicle, you do have your auto lights just down there. Foot on the brake, you have keyless start. Now, as you can see, it is free from any one lights on the dashboard. Now, you do get the orange triangle. That is just because it is low fuel. As you just saw pop up, as you can see, range, please refuel 22 miles. We do get the digital dash there as well, so you can change the look of the screen on the right-hand side. As you can go through all the different settings. So, whatever suits your preferences, you can then choose from. Now you do get the multifunction steering wheel, your cruise control and speed limiter, as well as paddle shift on the rear if you want to stick out into manual mode, as well as your auto wipers. And then you have the BC, which can change the look of the, on the screen. Now you do have the big screen in the center. Now you do have the function where you can go like that and it'll go, it'll change the radio. So it turns the volume up or down. So yeah, as you can see it just there then. As you can see, there it is again. Now the screen is fully touchscreen, so if you press home. You can also use this, the touchpad just down here as well to go through all the different settings. So you do have your media. Now you do have Spotify music collection, Bluetooth audio, screen mirroring and mobile devices, and you do also have the DAB function. You also have Bluetooth phone connectivity. Again, back to satellite navigation, and you also have the navigation. If you go home, and go across, you do also have these different settings here as well, where driving style analysis, value since individual, the local traffic situation, what direction you're traveling in, and also date and time, the weather, and also some news there for you as well. Now if I go to apps, you do also have all these different apps there as well. And go back, back to home, and go into car, you also have all these different settings just there as well. I'll just go back off that. 
I'll pop it into reverse, you do have your rear reversing camera with your front and rear parking sensors just there. And you also have your parking assist there as well. I do get dual zone climate control, which works just as you would expect it to. Nice control from just down there, and you've got the screen in the center just there, which lets you know the temperature. And that does work exactly how you would expect it to. Now, you do also have two heated front seats, so for those cold winter ones, it really does make all the difference. Now, I do get the BMW individual trim all around this vehicle with the ambient lighting, which is a very nice addition, and really does make it quite homely inside. Push the BMW individual trim open just down here, and then you do get two nice sized cup holders. USB connectivity as well as 12 volt connectivity with some storage just down there. You do also have your wireless charging for your phones just in there as well. Pop that closed again. This is what you use to control F amps on the screen if you're not using the touchscreen function. So if you say you have media, telephone connectivity, home, internet, maps, and nav, and also back an option. Now I do have the air suspension fitted to this vehicle so you can raise and lower it by this little toggle right here. Then the lights will then flash as you can see just there. We do have downhill ascent assist, electric parking brake, and we do also have different drive modes where we do have adaptive. I'll just go off that main screen. I do have adaptive. Also have Eco Pro, Comfort, and also Sport with Sports Plus and Individual. They do have your engine stop start, stop start technology, as well as track control on and off, and also your parking sensors. Soft touch lever armrest with storage just in there as well from push of a button just there. And there's a look at the passenger's full lever front seat with extended fire support if you may need it, same as the driver's seat. Now again, you do have the electric function just down there. So it's been with an individual trim with the ambient lighting all around this vehicle. Now this vehicle is available to take away today with free consulates nationwide next day delivery. It's HPI clear, comes with fresh service and we do offer competitive low finance. Thank you very much for watching. video test drive of this BMW X5. Now the purpose of this video today is to show you that the car drives exactly how you would expect it to. For example now I'm not having to wrestle with the steering wheel to keep the vehicle in a straight line. I'll also go through some of the vehicle's features and demonstrate that they work exactly how they should. As a viewer I would suggest that you listen out for any knocks, any bangs and really just treat this experience as if you were here with me in the Today. Now starting off we have got both cruise control and speed limiter on the steering wheel just here. To activate cruise control I'll simply press cruise, push up on the trigger and we're now cruising at our current speed. Very easy to adjust the speed in increments of 1 or to the nearest 5 and then to deactivate this we can simply press cancel it or apply pressure to the brakes. We've then got our gear changes so I'm currently in 6th gear down to 5th, 4th third, fourth, third, and then I'll go back into automatic as we approach the roundabout. And as you can tell, through those gear changes, completely seamless transitions, no jerky motions, no unwanted sounds, all working exactly as you would expect. Now, this car is full of great features. My favorite probably, probably being the Sky Lounge panoramic glass roof which if you haven't seen before, I'd suggest that you have a look online for that. It looks fantastic at night time. We've then got our Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, wireless charging capabilities, digital display in here in harmony with the infotainment screen in the middle that is jammed full of great features. Really nice place to be in here. It feels really high tech and really spacious as well. Great place to be sat here. Now here at RS Car Sales, we have been doing deliveries for the last three to four years as well as free next day nationwide deliveries for the last year and a half as well. We are a five star, five star dealership too. If you look online, we've got over 300 five star reviews on Google and Auto Trader alone, as well as many others on other sites like Car Gurus. So if you go online, check out these reviews, you'll see that our customers really do reiterate the fact that we are a dealership that cares. We really do want you to have such a good buying experience from ourselves that you would recommend us to your friends, to your family, and even come back to us when the time is due for your next vehicle purchase. Now you can find us on social media as well. We are on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and TikTok. So make sure to follow us on those platforms. To keep up to date with all the latest stock we get in and see what we get up to at RS Car Sales. Now as I'm turning in here, I will perform an emergency brake in three, two, one. There we go, very sharp on the brakes, straight into reverse. We've got our reversing 
camera as well as front and rear sensors on the display just there. And then one last test for the vehicle as we are about to go over the speed bump to listen out for any knocks or any bangs. There we go, completely free from any knocks or bangs throughout this whole journey, which of course you would be listening out for if you were here with me today. So this is usually where you'd be extremely happy with the vehicle. You'd want to come inside, see what kind of deal you could work out. Obviously, you're not here at the moment, but do feel free to get in touch. Part exchanges are welcome. Just let us know the make, model and condition of the vehicle you're wishing to part exchange. And if there is anything we have missed and I have the online photos, the video walk around or this video test drive, Again, feel free to get in touch and one of the team would be more than happy to help you out. That's all from me on today's video. I hope you found this useful and we'll hopefully hear from you soon. Cheers.